recognize the extent of my remarks. Without objection, the gentleman is recognized for one minute. Mr. Speaker, January is National Slavery and Human Trafficking Prevention Month, and it is a perfect time to highlight the terrible reality of sex trafficking that is happening in our communities. It's also an opportunity, Mr. Speaker, an opportunity to take steps to combat this growing problem that now puts 300,000 children at risk in the United States, many of whom are 12 to 14-year-old girls. I'm authoring several bipartisan bills to address sex trafficking. One gives law enforcement additional tools to turn the tide against sex trafficking and help the victims of these horrific crimes receive the support they need and deserve. And that's what these young girls are, victims. The second bill improves data systems that track missing children because better information will help us find better solutions. Mr. Speaker, it's time to end sex trafficking, and there's bipartisan support for action. I yield back.